Hi folks and welcome to another video and for this video I thought it'd be nice if we looked at lamps as we've been looking at lanterns in the last few videos I thought it'd be nice just to do some of my favourite lamp the metal halide uh, elliptical shaped lamp or egg shaped as I like to call it with the E and got two examples here one at 250 watt and one at 400 watts as well so what we'll do is we'll look at the 250 watt one basically the envelopes are the same size you would have thought it would have been bigger uh, I have a, a Son one HPS one which has a bigger um, envelope at 400 the 400 watt version of a Son so let's look at this one first then okay right this is a rather interesting I like this this is rather interesting it's got like a razor blade at the top if you know what that is called Please put it in the comments below. But this one basically has a real basic setup. Um, there's no heat disc on this one. Some have heat disc on. It's got the classic belly button there to hold the, the structure of the lamp and the art tube. Also, this one it's got like an insulated re or heat resistant even part of it there. Let's, let's get it in focus the camera. There we go. And it's a bit along there. There we are. Now this one is made by, as you can see there on the edge, CED. CED, you can see that there. Let's try and get it in the light a bit better. There we, there we go. CED. Now these make a lot of uh, products for tool station, which is like a DIY warehouse. Um, I had a few CED lamps, not too bad. They last all right. But, uh, and it also says there that it's compatible with a mercury ballast as well. So there we are, and I'll show you the box to this one in a bit as well. We're moving up to the bigger one. Ah, this is a this is a good one. Bigger art tube in there, straight away. It's a bigger art tube. Nice little bit of foily stuff going on at the bottom there. You see, just here, down there somewhere. There's some foil there, just there. Mm, maybe a cutout of some kind. Mm, the mind boggles, but there's. Uh, there's no other th another indication of what that one is there. Again, we've got the protected occasion going up to the top. And around the back we have this other single strand cable. I don't know if you can see that on the... It's around about here. Look, it's just, it just goes over. There we go. Both the lanterns have um, ceramic bases because of the heat that these things generate. Uh, although we look at the most uh, popular ones are the old tube ones like this one here. There we go. The only difference is this one has a resistor just here on it. Or here, should I say? It's always difficult to point on the camera. Ah, there we go. So that one. This is 150 watt. I think this is. It could be a four. No, this is a 400 watt. I do remember where this one comes from. Though, yeah, this is a 400 watt. Uh, Similar size envelope uh, to that one. So there we go. Anyway, tubes are popular, but I like these ones, the egg shape. I like this, I love this kind of shape of lantern. And about the smaller one, I heard you ask. Yes, well, here's 150 watt made a by Adventure, popular with street light and lamps. This is the baby of the bunch. Look at this tiny little one. Look at that. There's its, its etch on there. Very difficult to try and get the etches to show up on this camera, but there's the etch there. There we go, 150 watt. Could fire this one up. I have got a couple of 150 watt lanterns, but they're in the back of the shed and I can't be bothered to get them out at the moment. But it'd be nice if I had uh, the gear to fire up all of these and just to give you the 400, the, the difference in the size. Look, the 400 and the little baby one. And the little baby one has a heat disc in it. See that? It's got a little heat disc in the base of it there. Look, just to protect the heat from the cap. Um, I think the cap on that is um, black ceramic. I can't be too quite sure on that. But when it comes to the size of lamps, so it's not necessarily the size of the envelope is what's inside the art tube. Now, I've got one here which is absolutely massive compared to anything else. Anything else 
this is a Sylvana 400 watt Son and this is a monster now look at that look at the size of that com compared to this can I get it on the camera shot ah that might that might be a bit better hold on a minute let's see if we can get it like this in the camera yeah um there you go <laughs> this is tiny 400 compared to this son this is a son one this is a 400 watt son so you know bigger the lamps the better thousand watt one i would love to get hold of and um, hopefully i can get a 400 watt um, ballast to do both so just a little overall look at these different kind of lamps with elliptical because i do like this shape lamp i can i can put all my lamps to this shape to be honest uh, that's the got ceramic as well this is a nice big one as well i've actually got a coated uh, metal halide uh, which is in the window in there. I'll show you that another day. I would do another video on that. But this is the big, this is the big boy. That's a big boy one. But these are great as well. This is the box for the pulse light, the 250 watt one, which is this one here that we just looked at. And I'll put them back in the boxes until I get a display box to put them on. There we go. Let's make sure we don't break any. We don't want no breakages. There we, are. there we go. And that's the pulse light one. There we go. That's all the markings. Metal halide. Blah, blah, blah. And blah, 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 blah. And there. And this is the CED one, which actually says Alliance Lighting on the box. But is it Alliance Lighting or is it not? We don't know. This is the, actually, I've got that wrong, haven't I? This isn't the 250 watt one. We put them in the wrong boxes. That is because the size are exactly the same. You know what I mean, anyway. So there you go. There's a little look at some metal halides. There we are. Put them all back safely. And of course, hopefully, one day, I shall get some gear to get these to go. And uh, we'll have a good old lighting up. But there you go then, that's a quick look at Metal Halide. Thanks for watching the video, thanks for coming along, and we'll see you on the next one. And please do comment and subscribe, um, and give it a like. Yes, one of these, why not? Okay, and be safe, electricity, be careful with it. I do it, so you don't have to. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.